hello guys so in this tutorial I am now I am going to install Oracle database software in ASM storage so let me log in software database run installer uncheck the notification skip software update create and configure a database obviously I I will choose desktop class cause I am uh, installing in my laptop so here is the detail and my global database name will be online password choose your password It's saying that whatever password I am given, it's not Oracle recommended. So here I will first uh, install the database software single instance ok all are ok will be DBA so database software installation is ongoing it will take uh, 25 to 30 minutes so and uh, during the 70 or 80 percent in the 70 or 80 percent installation it will ask you to run a script so till then I have you have to do nothing so to reduce the video length I am going to pause the video here and again I am telling you uh, during the installation if I am getting any difficulties or error I will get back there will troubleshoot thank you thank you for and stay with us so at the 94 percent of installation it will ask you to run the root script uh, a script as a root user it's not copying of have to run this script manually slash u01 app oracle product 11 point db home root sh ok so escape is successfully executed software also su successfully 
installed now I will create the database DB DBCA Uh, DBC is, is the tool to create and delete the database. Uh, DBC means database configuration assistance. Next, create database. Yes, general purpose. Database name will be online next. Put the sys password. It, it, uh, no, it, it's the database CC password so here I have to choose the automatic storage management uh, now I have to specify the uh, flash recovery area next it will ask me the ASM password Uh, during the ASM uh, grid infrastructure software installation, the which the password which you have entered, you have to put that password here. Okay, enable archiving, first recovery area. So database will be data. and first recovery area will be first recovery disk enable the sample schema next next finish okay so database creation is ongoing so here also I don't have uh, now I don't have to do anything so database will create it automatically so till then I am going to pause the video again either video length will be high so stay with me so uh, now it's uh, asking me about the password I am uh, exiting so database installation is done so SQL so So this is the my database name and instance name. So in next tutorial, I will show you uh, how to uh, what is the processes of grid infrastructure and how to add delete the ASM disk. So thank you, thank you for watching.